A night guard is a dental appliance designed to protect teeth from the effects of grinding and clenching during sleep. It helps reduce pressure on the jaw joints, preventing excessive wear on teeth and minimizing strain on the muscles and TMJ. However, the effectiveness of a night guard depends on its design. Poorly made ones can worsen symptoms by forcing the jaw into an incorrect position. Most dentists make night guards for their patients, but many patients complain about how the night guard makes them feel. And there's a reason for this. Most dentists will take an impression or a scan of a patient and send this to their lab to make a night guard. So here's what typically happens when a night guard is made. Most labs take the impression or scan they got from the dentist and open the bite using a hinge movement. Now hinging simply means rotation and the rotation occurs at the jaw joint or condyle level. Why is this a problem? Hang in there, I'm about to show you. When a lab makes a night guard, it's usually for the upper teeth, opening the bite on a hinge. Now think about this. Where do the lower teeth go when you hinge the mandible at the condyle level? They shift slightly backwards. This means that the mandible is retruded when the bite opens on a hinge. A retruded mandible may be okay for some patients, but many patients don't like how it feels and many complain of increased pain as a result of wearing their night guard. Here's why.